Hey folks, this is Urson. Welcome back to Phoenix Point. We're in it. We're in it with our chupa thingy. See where the enemies are at. We launched some rockets. Now apparently we have only very few rounds and no reloads on this Gemini ass kicker. So that's a thing. Can we ram stuff still? Because remember that was a thing we could do. Maybe it's only if we can pilot it. Remember in the other, in the other game, you know, at the beginning when everything was cool and better, we could, you know, do things with this one. Anyway. A lot of crates up here. This seems to be a happy place here. Objective of some sort. Um, not sure where the enemies are going to be. It's kind of annoying that we brought a vehicle and this map is super building focused. <laughs> this might be a bit of a pain in the ass. Alright. Assault. Let's go, Damien. Let's go. Let's see what we got here. Target in sight. Yes, master. Hey. Are you the usual... You little brand of shit. Spitter. Grenade launcher. Pinsa. He pinch. Okay, yeah. He, he pinch. Five by five. Five by five. Okay, let's get on over this way. Okay, we'll get the overwatches going. We'll hear enemies sooner rather than later. Like, oh, you have a line on this guy? For real, bro? But only... I mean, we could technically do this. We gotta have it just like that. I mean, I do think this is probably not the worst idea in the world. If I just come here, and I can use quick shot, use some will. I got... That is... A sniper rifle mag? Sure, I'll take that. Oh no, this mine, sorry, whoops. Iron Fury. Another medikit. That's not bad. But the problem is this costs me one action point to take. Oh, I'm an over-encumbered here. Oh, okay. So I'm going to leave this alone. But I do want to take a shot at this guy. Oh, I can still shoot. No, I can't. I can do quick shot. There, quick game. Boom. There you go. Now I can. Try to get his arm. Nice. Now, which arm is disabled? I think it's his pincer. I keep getting the pincers, I think. Nope, that's his grenade arm. Okay, sick. That's awesome. That is wonderful. Just as I wanted to see. No more shots. Perfect where you are. We just perfect. And we can go inventory, but I can't even remove anything, so this is all good. Can I scoot a little more? Um... Just stand by, I guess. It's fine. Okay, that thing twitches. Kill it. Same deal. And I'm gonna go ahead and um, bring... Chuba thing up this way. Oh, dude, that thing is... Oh, it just runs over shit, don't it? Yeah, let's just make it a nice target. It does not care. That's amazing. It doesn't take damage from that, too, does it? Nice. Nice. Alright, well, we'll just keep it in support here for now. I don't want to go too crazy. I mean, this is technically what I want them to shoot, though, so... It's fine. And for now, I want that thing to run up... ...and just try to punch that. Okay, so he's at 50. Ooh, plugged him. Nice shot. Okay, and no other sounds. It's fascinating. I got the Aries. 200 HP. No visual or audio cues on any other oppo, which is really weird. Okay. Receiving loud and clear. Okay, well, my suggestion is snipers. Get on the roof. You can still go further than this, or this is all your movement. This is all your movement in it. Right, let's wing it. Get on the roof, see what we got. What do we got? Nergal's Wrath. Hand Cannon. Sinedron Crossbow Quiver. Dude, this is gonna be dope. I'm just grabbing that because that is... Weird. Not enough action points. Alright. We'll get all these things. 
You just hang, hang, buddy. You just hang. And then you Overwatch here, I guess. I got this covered. Overwatch this way. Oh chupa thing, we saw chupa thing. Crap, I forgot. Oh. We have friends now. Hi. I can do this still, right? I really do want that thing dead, ideally. I don't like you. Do it like that. We're gonna break some shit, friends. That was awesome. I love that. A lot. Yep, another guy. There's, there's another sound there, apparently. Okay. Mind fraggers, okay. That's creepy. But that was awesome. I'm so glad I brought you. You're my new friend. Alright. Did I damage the Iron Fury? I might have. It's fine. Hey, you drive up. <laughs> this is just the advantage of having some massive tanks. Just drive up and see what's there. Okay, some mind fragger there, but we don't have visual on what that thing is. Is there anything out there that I should worry about? I heard. Okay, there's nothing. So that was just sound that we heard, but there's actually nothing confirmed. Okay, fine. And again, I don't need to go crazy on this. Cause, did we break the roof on this thing? Kind of. Oh, we could have blown a hole in this, I suppose. I don't have any action points enough. It's okay. Um, the Mindfragger is a little scurry. <laughs> Get it? He scurries. Oh, but I have a line here. Perfect. Hello, friend. And I want to disable your arm, ideally. Um. Huh. Where's the shot going to be best? And I only need two for Overwatch. I might quick aim again. Just so I can save an Overwatch in case that Mindfire comes out of the woodwork. That might be the right option. I'm going to do that just preemptively. That's the pincer arm, which is kind of the downside. I'm going to take a swing there, maybe to penetrate. Nice. Good penetration. We can swap out and maybe take another plug at this thing. That's just not a good move. Yeah, this is... I highly doubt that's going to work too well. I need to overwatch in case that freaking minefire comes out the window. I mean, like this. It comes up at me this way. That's what I'm worried about. I'm on overwatch. Ideally, we can find a line on this guy. We could just grenade him and call it a day. Uh, this is the danger here, of course, is that... Oh, we can get a line on him here. Does he have a shield? No, he doesn't. Okay. So roll up. We'll dash, and if that thing attaches to someone's face, we just shoot it off. Get me a line. Oh, where was, where was the line you had? Probably better here, right? Away from the mind fragger. Yeah. Let's get there if we can. Yep. Perfect. Ready to fire. We'll plug him full of holes. It's 100% kill? Yeah, it is. Handled. Okay, now you. Where do you have a line on the minefire? There. Only there? Really? Yeah. Do you have dash? You have dash too. Okay, that's fine. So get up there. Dash it to a spot. You had the line here, right? Yeah, you had the line there. I'm gonna put him here in case this gets weird. And try to take this thing out. You don't want to fuck around with this thing. Good. Handled. Oh, that was it? They said it was a high oppo. Okay. Good job, Chupa Thingy. Alright, so no experience on that thing, but that thing just, <laughs> that just broke most of our enemies. Amazing. Alright, that was good. I'll take it. No complaints, friends. 
Yeah, when they said mo- no, it wasn't heavy, but it was definitely it's definitely moderate, wasn't it? Yeah, it definitely was. Alrighty. We'll figure it out. Scavenging site cleared. So we got all the stuff that we saw. Yup. You're a creepy bastard. But that's okay. I'll live with it. Alright, that's pretty good. I forgive the slight jump there. Um, I apparently very strange. I, I saw my audio peaking really hard, and I thought I'd be peaking, basically. I'd be clicking constantly, but no, we're alright. How are we doing at base? So you've just got a little bit of stamina lost, but that's fine. How are you guys doing? Uh, personnel. I just do it from here, okay. Um, you're healed up, you're healed up. Jabibski's still sitting there bleeding. But who's actually on, on site? So you're in the Manticore. Pyro's healed up, so she's just recovering. She's no rounds, so I have to switch out weaponry potentially. I might have to swap this out. Yeah, yeah, I would take Psycho, Pyro, Jabibski, Atlid Torso, and maybe Lout. I'll have to get someone from the aircraft who's still a little mentally fragged, but alright, we'll figure it out. I mean, Lecture 21, I think that'd take a li- way longer. Apparently, time does not pass um, in mission, which is interesting, but the goal is to get to Phoenix Bay, South America, right? So, what I want to probably do. You guys still have enough stamina to run this, right? 27. I remember when, the, I think it's like under half stamina that we have a problem. Ah, uh, the exclamation point means this is not in max. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, let's hit another mission, I guess. And then we'll do maybe the this mission. Secure the cryogenics lab. Hopefully we can do that. Um, let's see what's here. We have chupa thingy, so I'm not too worried about running too hard. Uh, let's deploy an area scan first of all, because we need to get to South America. And we also need to explore. And there's a thing that's going to happen. The temple. The uh, Manticore wanted to take an abandoned structure. On landing, our operatives have been able to identify it. Someone has constructed a huge metal spire, welding together hundreds of pieces of abandoned junk and strange objects that 20, 30 meters high towers. Take off and undisturb it. Oh, we're gonna fuck around with it. Okay. Blood, sweat, and heavy duty cutting equipment are team managed to hack apart the structure. No one will ever know what it was for. I, I figured it was about the disciples. We lost 10 stamina, though. 450 materials really isn't that much. And, alright, that's. I, I, I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Alright, move to the base. Yeah, if we're all out of stam... We didn't lose 10 stam, we lost 3. Y- you lying. You can wait, just let time pass. Okay. Pause, pause, pause. Haven nowhere, under attack by Pandorans. Can we get here? Um, okay. What is information? You have covered... Military Shing 9. Okay, so they're, they're weaker here. I really want to defend this. Okay. So we'll try to defend them. The team we have with the Chupa thingy. I think Chupa thingy will do work here. Let's move. Don't die. Okay, our first haven defense. Attitude change on victory. Sinedrin likes. This haven will love us. Medium threat. That's fine. We just went through medium threat mission. Um, and intermediate to eliminate threat. Taking many sieves. Successfully receive a reward from the haven. Okay. I mean, let's go. Do it. Start the mission. Uh, Christ, I hope you don't run out of rounds. How many rounds do you have? 42 out of 60. You're doing fine. Oh, I have a laser salt mag on my body also, so no, I'm fine. Give me that bullshit. You're okay. Not fully loaded. It's okay, man. Alright, you're fine. And you're fine. Alright, no, I mean, this is... This is what we train for, baby. 
Oh, gas salt rifle probably does work. I don't have gas rounds though, do I? No, I do. I could rock the bulldog. Is there? Is it better? Let me see. 30 damage on a 6 round burst. With 25 effective range. And 2 action points. So 30, 6, 25, 2. Versus 44, 22. Okay, so lower range. More damage per round. And the lower burst. And I wonder if the spread or accuracy is better. But probably going to be worse. So 160 versus potentially 180. Yeah, I need to get closer to work it. And I think I'll keep here. I think I'm alright with this. And one mag is probably enough for this mission. Medium threat shouldn't be that bad. Alright. No, the crew looks good. I mean, y'all need to stop telling me that because we're okay. Deploy the squad. Paralysis damage. Ugh. They just totally paralyzed greater than strength. That's scary. We seeing some new shit we ain't never seen before. Like paralysis. Not so good. Anyway, let's see. So we gotta save save civvies. I, I hope they can get into my chuba thingy. Just like open the door, like get the civvies in there and have them to drive and rocket the fuck out of these things. That seems like a good plan, right? Sending untrained civilians to massive military hardware. Tell me you can see the drop of the vehicle. Can you see the vehicle? Oh, I wanted the vehicle to be like right there in the back where it's clamped. I has to sads. Phoenix forces. So, civilians alive. How many do I need to keep alive? This is also a valid question. Is it kind of like an XCOM mission where you just kind of move up and then call it a day? Where are my troops at? Are they all here? Please tell me they're all... Okay, they are in roughly in the same spot. That's good. Let's see. Get on up here. Enemy in visual range. Got visual. Got you. Okay. Don't necessarily want to take a shot that would potentially put me in a place where I pick off a civilian. Feel bad about that. I do have a line of sight here again if I use quick aim, which I'm probably going to do. I don't think I have a good shot though. Quick aim yet? Very useful, that ability. Holy fuck, that better not hit the civilian. Be embarrassed if it does. Jesus. Um, I don't have a great shot on this guy. Really kind of don't. At most I get is pincer. I just don't want that like 50% chance to wing that civilian's arm. Chances are I'm going to miss this, but let's give it a swing. Damn. Yeah, it was... That was a tough shot. Can we... Go here and get you... Out of here? Like this? Uh, under Phoenix control. Okay, and do we... Can we exfil you? We can exfil you, right? Okay, get over here. So that's what it gives me. It gives me that, and I can get exfil, I think, and that's what I need to do. Okay. That's fair. Get over here. That's fine. Yeah, if I hadn't cleared them before... That's such a good point. If I had cleared them before, I'd actually have something to do in Overwatch. Where's that horrifying thing? It's over there. Yeah, don't hit the civilian. Whatever you do, don't hit the civilian. Just give me that cone. Away from, uh, uh, that's fine. Yes, you have a line of sight on this guy. Oh, God. The range. The range, baby. The range. Give me that swing. Ready to fire. You might actually do this well. Give me more center of mass. Yeah, at this range, you guys hit center of mass. Let's go. Your aim is really good. I pissed him off a little bit. I want Chupa Thingy to be the target. So I'm going to move Chupa Thingy up. Make it as hard as possible for them to draw a bead on these civilians. Probably uses this cover too, so. Sorry for your haven. <laughs> we kind of ran over some shit, but we're alright. You don't get to launch her from here, bro. Oh, hey. Wow, did you come out of nowhere? 
You son of a bitch. Please don't hit the civilian. Okay, another guy's there. That civvy is very dead. Oh. Hit a little bit of damage, took some of the armor off. No worries. I'm assuming that civilian is very, very dead. Okay, so let's do, see if I understand how this works. Can you exfil? Yep, you can exfil. Good. Exfil the civvy. So this works, actually. Yep, exfil. All right. So you are bleeding horribly. You still have this thing to deal with. Chupa thing, you took some damage, but again, not a big deal. This thing is tanky as fuck all. Um, all right. Ideally, I'd have a shotgun this close. Yeah, ideally I'd have a shotty this close, but this is going to be a little tricksy. And this thing is annoying. But what I want to do is get the civilian under my control, will away, and then drop rockets on this thing. And then we'll be ready for whatever's going to hit that. I'm not sure if that's going to give me the activation I need, though. What's disabled on you? Do you do that same stealthing BS? Oh no, you just regenerate. Okay, that's fine. As long as you don't do the dumbass stealth crap. Blood sucking arm. <laughs> oh, that's creepy as shit. So you're not as annoying as the other guy. You're more dangerous in this case. Okay, let's let's plan out our actions. You still have a line, but more this guy is annoying, so I need to get a line on that guy, but he's just sitting in that building and he's gonna yuts around. These solutions, I do not like them. Okay. So get here. Do the step by step. You got fucked up. How much HP do you have? You have 40 and you're bleeding slowly. Okay, so you actually might be able to get out. You have a disabled arm, but you might actually pull this off. You not take cover? No, you do, but that is not cover. Okay, you just get the hell as far away from this as possible. <laughs> Leaving a trail of blood. Everything is normal. Alright, Chupa thingy. Ooh, that might destroy what's in the case, though. This is some, could be some pretty sick duds. This is a Synedrion Haven, after all. They have really slick gear. Yeah, I'm not shooting my friendly unit there, buddy. Yeah, no thanks. You still have a lot of movement left. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna take this on faith. I'm gonna do, but this is a little dangerous. This thing up here, I don't know what's in there. And unfortunately, all the cool loots are here. All right, move this way. See what's in the loot. See if it's worth to blow up or not. Just crossbow quivers. Okay, it's not actual crossbow, so that's less exciting. Well, can I take that on my? No, I, I want to take the swing. I think. Alright, he's awfully close to shoot. I might be able to... Can I just destroy this thing? It looks like I might be able to kill this thing straight up. That's a lot of damage, and I make it bleed. Pretty good. Okay, that's a l very low roll for what I just saw. I might have to dash here and let the rockets do the work, because that's not going to do it for me. And that crossbow stuff, not that exciting. Um, yeah, get the hell out of here. That's not, that's not safe, man. That is not a safe place to be. Right, Lout. Give me some shots on this thing. You seem unpleasant. Are you bleeding? Please tell me you're bleeding to death. Hello? Thank you. Info. 10 HP. He regenerates 10. To all body parts each turn. I'm not sure if that's going to be a kill or not. I have concerns. Alright, anyway. 
Sniper boy. So I need to wreck whatever that is. I can't bunch up too much, because if that thing's a grenade hucker, then I'm going to be up a shit creek here. Targeting. Which will do you have? You have seven will. That's a, that's, this is lethal? Lethal. I'll take lethal. Done. Good. And then this is the next action. Next shot, the pressure weapon is reduced by one. Alright. Take this up, and I want you to overwatch. In case something gets weird out of up here. Where could he leave from? He would have to leave from this way. I technically should be able to cover this space if necessary. You don't really have options. So that leaves us with chupa thingy. I mean, if I'm going to blow something up, it might as well be good, right? Get rid of it. Hey. You're doing the job. You're tanking very well. Yeah, he ain't happy. I like that he ain't happy. Alright, chupa thingy. Be the target. Cool. You're just gonna stand by. You, uh, I wish you could wiggle into cover. I mean, you just wiggle away from that civilian, so if something is gonna grenade us, it'll hit the troops potentially. Kind of do that. It's not the best idea, I guess, but... Synedrion. Oh, civilians, yeah, yeah. Oh, the civilian in there. Oh, crap, okay. Didn't realize there's civilian in there. Hmm? Fuck, Al. Oh, you're about to have a bad day, buddy. Oh, another guy. Okay. So that's a hostile up top. You go after civilians. Oh, we gotta get in there. Okay, step one. Exfil. Pardon me, sorry. Real life beckons. Alright. Exfil. This is a problem. I need Chupa Thingy to solve that problem for me. You should be able to launch this and not break too much, right? Probably, yeah. Let's see how this works. Okay, did I get that thing? Well, kinda. Somehow it didn't die, which is terrifying. Bleeding that much, I'd expect it to burn already. Okay. I'm gonna line us on this guy from here somehow. I could broke the window. Good. Oh, it's all like screwed up and stuff and colorful. We gotta work on this thing too somehow. Ready to fire. I really don't like these launcher arms, man. Can't really get at it too much. We'll just go center of mass and do as much damage as possible. And go from there. Okay, it's bleeding 10. It ain't bleeding much, though. Alright. Stand by for now. I need a line of sight on whatever the hell that thing is. There it is. Thank you. Ah, bleeding 50. You might not be worth my time. You are not worth my time. You die at the beginning of next turn. Perfect. Only have your head active too. Okay, give me a line. Can I get a line on the other guy? Where'd I have to be to get a line on the other guy? The answer is nowhere close. It's frustrating. He's bleeding a bit, but he's gonna chew on that civilian some more, and that's not a, that's not okay. How do I get through here? Are these doors. These must be doors. Yeah, I'd have to. I do some pretty heavy shit to get through here. This is just putting me in line for a pretty nasty shot. But I'm gonna have to do what I need to. I can probably will forward and get there. You will forward. Dash up. Am I gonna have a line? Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have a line there. Yeah, okay. I think I'll have a good shot from there. God, I hope I will. This will probably be even better, though. That'll be a better line. Can I wheel all the way up there? 
Kinda, yeah. Alright, do it. Drive forward, buddy. Save some lives. You, it doesn't look like you're actually gonna die. That's terrifying. That guy is done to die, though. Alright. Yeah, this guy's what you want to shoot. Yeah, there's, there's, there's a lethal here. It was right when I targeted him. Hold on. Okay, it's not what I intended to do, but that works. I intended to uh, re-aim. And there's another guy there. Crap. Alright. How much will do you have? You have eight out of eight. I can get you in this position. But that doesn't put you in any safe places. But let's just get you moving. Let's whip there. Yep, perfect. And you just have a shot on the guy that's gonna die next turn anyway. 50. Yeah, yeah this is fine. Alright, you haul ass. This way. So now that guy's gonna die. Moving now. Try to get the last thing up. Maybe I can distract him with uh, the chupa. The goat soccer. Go this way. Sorry about your haven. It's looking a lot uglier now, I know. Just stand by. I think that one civilian might not make it. Yep. Hmm. We lose will if we lose civilians. I did not realize that. Okay. Sounds like it's the last bugger here. Should be able to get him pretty good. Well, wait, wait. It zoomed in on a uh, potential kill shot already. That looks pretty good, but I don't trust it. There we go. Yep. Do that. Is anyone saved? Yes. Boo to the yaw. Do we save all the civilians? No, we lost one. One guy bit it. Chupa thing is damaged, but that's fine. We'll repair it. Seven out of eight is pretty good. Nice. All right. Good job, everyone. That worked really well. So that Haven's really going to like us. Uh, not that it has too many useful facilities for us, but it's a thingy, and we'll take it. And I think we're going to call it there for today. We get all the goodies. See you all next time here on Phoenix Poir. Nice not. Okay, I got some reading to do. Sinedrin probably seems strange to you, from Citizen Zara. Trying to build a better world, a world radically different than the one most of us grew up in. I'm sure it sounds very utopian, but why do we so easily accept the world getting worse? Can never imagine it getting better. The world never gets better. <laughs> can you better not we said it didn't do it? Eh, we can definitely get better. We're gonna kill all the aliens. I'm Their values are aligned, at least in this matter. Keep thinking about what kind of world you want to live in. Ah, there we go. Please keep thinking about what kind of world you want to live in. Maybe we can build it together. Maybe. Your accent is off the chain. Oh, what is this? A Pandoran nest. Seems like a scary mission to go in on. I want to kind of hit this mission too at some point. We're definitely injured. And we're really low on stamina. Everyone in Phoenix Point is healed, apparently. We got new soldiers there available. We can't fit anymore. We need to get to this South American mission. That isn't. That is a ship, I think. Huh. There's a lot of things to think about. Anyway, we're going to think about this all next time. For now, I've been Nurse. I'll see you all next time. Till then.